Hey guys, we're over here in Laguna by 9th Street. The John Wayne Beach House. Interesting. And check this out. Jessica is counting the steps. 215 steps. Uh, due to rising tides, high tide, we have to close the cave. It's a little dangerous to be going through. There's no way you can go to it. This is stuck on the inside. We're on our way back up. Crystal Cove State Park. Wow, it's a lot of wild What's the matter? I just don't know. I just want to see if it comes out or whatever. Oh, I got my whistle, you know what I'm saying? You think it's a snake or something? Uh -huh. So, my friend Jessica and I, we've been exploring caves, or trying to look for caves and arches today down over by Laguna Beach, California. Uh, 1,000 Steps Beach, which if you actually go down the steps, it, the count of the steps is 215 steps, uh, you know, for anyone who cares. But, um, so when we tried to get to those uh, immediate beach, the first beach cave, as you make a left down the stairs, um, one of the lifeguards came to us and told us that it was closed, uh, which is a little frustrating because I flew out here and that was one of the highlights I was looking forward to. Um, so what we tried to do was, let's say, okay, let's go back up the stairs and let's go in a different way and see if we can access the beach case from a different entrance. So the next beach entrance was, uh, I believe it was Vista del Sol Street. It runs parallel to 9th Street with a couple blocks down. And when we tried, then there was a private property uh, manager that uh, informed us that access to like the tide pools and like the beach cave is apparently private property uh, from that side. Uh, so once again, uh, shut down, um, you know, trying to meet our objective today with, with sea caves. So then, after uh, buying some uh, Akai those like sugary like a high fruit bowls you know um we're like all right screw it. let's go to crystal cove so we went to crystal cove hiked a little bit did some coastal hiking and then we actually accidentally found i believe is the sea cave called little treasure cove um if you plug that into Waze or you know i think google maps or even iphone maps it it takes you to like a person's residence so it's technically the fastest way streetwise to get to somebody's backyard so we're running into this private property thing again but if you go into crystal cove state park and if i figured this out today if you park on zone lot 205 that's the fastest way publicly you can get to that ck 